welcome back everybody. We have changed positions now. We're kind of doing something a little different. We're not casting on the oyster bars. What it is, the tide's going, coming in, the wind's blowing the opposite way. And what happens is, is these fish get up here and float and they're just waiting for stuff to come by and they're eating them. So we're just out here waiting for them to come float up, pitch a bait over to them and whack them. Brian, you know you do one long cast and you're gonna see one of those come floating right every up next time. to the boat every, every single time. time. But uh, I love it when they're right close to the boat. And what they're doing when they're coming, are they getting warm or are they just kind no, of going they, on they the just cruise. It's very shallow here. You know, you'd think way out here would be deep, but it's, yeah. it's only a foot or two deep. So they just cruising these shallows, coming in with the mullet. Unbelievable. You it's see them floating right, right in front of us like that. Water's a little bit dirty, but they just, they come out of nowhere and it's just like these golden pumpkins, like over here, right here, look. Watch this, guys, right in front of us. Well, Y'all probably can't see that fish right there, but he's gonna see my bait in a second. There he comes. Oh, there he there is, he is Bubba, right there. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good hey, feeling, ain't yeah, it? Boy. That's a good that, feeling. That sound like string music. That's the new music, brother. The new, the sound new like, music of addicted fishing, right sound there. Sound like a cello. <laughs> string music. He's way out there, buddy. Golly. <laughs> <laughs> what we're doing here, the situation we have is the tide's kind of coming in here. We got an east wind, so it's kind of muddying up a little bit. And what the fish are doing, they're coming up here floating. They're either looking for bait or they're up here just getting warm and you just go along real slow. I got the Minn Kota like down on like three and just barely move it along, not to make a bunch of noise and it'll send them down. But as soon as you see them, you kill the Minn Kota, you put the talon down and you whack you a monster redfish. This one's a monster. Oh, look at him come up. God, I wish he'd get a sister with him. Might go out there and nail her too. Nobody with her. <sighs> I can't believe y'all don't like to chase these big guys. Oh, I do. Bright and red. Looks like one of them pond pumpkins we used to. Now, do these fish, just like in our neck of the woods down there, September, move way out in the Gulf to go spawn? Well, they stay in the Gulf. That's a breeder, you know, usually they end the thing and they get they come into the passes to spawn here. Yeah. Hey, you think people from Florida like fishing here or what? If y'all remember Captain Tad Vandermark, Captain Tad's right in front of us over there. And this big redfish is fixing to be landed right now. Look at that bait buster hanging there in his mouth. Well, I mean, Ooh, what a pretty! Too. He's got some purple in him. Love them colors. Woo! We got him one. On a fly. That's the way to do it on fly, right over there. Oh gosh! He's so <laughs> there he is. A toad. You know, Travis Tanner, my old FLW partner, he'd call that one a walrus. A walrus? <laughs> I'll call it a Mogan, baby. Oh, that's a good one right there, buddy. That's a bodacious red. That's what you come here for right there. <laughs> the bodacious red. <laughs> that right there. What a beautiful specimen of a redfish. Look right over your over your right shoulder, and we were hooked up on a fly right next to it. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> hooked up on a fly behind us. Probably one right about this size. Yep because that's all I've oh, seen. that's a nice fish, Blair. Look at that beautiful fish. What a fish. He's got a leech on him. We go free him with that one. Gorgeous fish. Unbelievable. You guys ever get the chance to come to Louisiana? I've said it every time I come to Louisiana. Come get you one of these, baby. Stay tuned, <laughs> we're gonna be right back with some more addictive fishing and some big old redfish. <laughs> <laughs> How about that one, brother? That's a good one. Fine. I need a break on the other side. I'm looking at the other one. <laughs>